music education using mobile applications. Question. Can mobile applications educate people on the varying facets of music? And in doing so, will it eliminate the traditional style of learning? First, to answer this question, we must understand music education and what it entails, and how mobile applications can help. Music education, since its inception, has been the product of a teacher-pupil relationship, or by listening and attempting to replicate what is heard. This has always been a time-consuming process that calls for prolonged dedication of time and resources. In the modern age, with people constantly on the go, there is less time to allocate to such activities. This results in less people pursuing a better understanding of music as a whole. With the advent of mobile devices came the birth of a new medium that swung open the doors of exploration and education, the mobile application. With the use of varying tools applications provide, learning has never been easier and more accessible. Classroom can be virtually anywhere the student needs to be. This gives the opportunity needed to learn music more conveniently and maybe even make the learning process more entertaining. Through the use of mobile applications, students can learn to play some musical instruments, learn to read sheet music, learn about music history, and even learn to appreciate music. The benefits of such a musical learning tool are absolutely astounding, but the question that needs to be asked is, will such a tool improve the learning process or will it dilute the information and ultimately damage music education? Mobile devices have become more commonplace everyday items throughout the world in just the last 20 years. In a 2009 press release, the International Telecommunications Union estimated 4.1 billion mobile cellular subscriptions worldwide as of the end of 2008. That's more than half of the world using mobile devices. That's not counting devices such as tablets and laptops. Even underdeveloped countries such as Botswana and Africa, mobile devices have become somewhat the norm. In 2001, only about 25 million people in Africa had mobile devices. But by 2013, this number has rocketed to about 650 million an increase of over 2,600%. Mobile devices so widespread, the ability to educate using mobile applications could prove to be very beneficial. Unfortunately, there's still a large amount of people around the world that have little to no access to mobile devices. This poses a problem. The process of learning through mobile applications is greatly diminished due to the student's need to first understand the device. Still, once the device is understood, they may fall behind those who have a long-standing relationship with technology. The reasons mobile applications, if used correctly, could greatly improve music education is due to its interactivity, its flexibility, and of course its mobility. Taking a closer look at interactivity, since most of the mobile devices on the market today use touch-enabled hardware, such as a touch screen or a touchpad, this adds a tactile dimension to the learning process. Granted, music is already a tactile experience, but the differing factor is the mobility of the device. Most popular instruments are larger than two feet such as a guitar, which can be very difficult to carry around on a daily basis. The mobile app that teaches how to play guitar by providing a visual representation of the strings and the ability to place one's fingers on the guitar fretboard. A student can practice the guitar anywhere. In the case of a piano student, the moving of their instrument from one place to another is a chore to say the least, with most pianos weighing anywhere between 50 to over 500 pounds. There are several applications that provide a partial keyboard to practice. 
there are some limitations with mobile application interactivity when it comes to learning a musical instrument. First, mobile applications may provide a great tool to learn finger placement, practice reading notes on a page, and educate about certain historical artists, but it has yet to reach a level of equality to a real instrument. For instance, when a student first learns to play the guitar, the most difficult task is getting past the initial pain felt when fingers are pressed down on the copper wound strings. This is an important process because the student develops callous fingertips which helps their performance and stamina in the future. Using mobile applications, students can gain the mental understanding without the physical workout. When the student of a mobile application transitions to a real instrument, he or she may be at a disadvantage. The second reason mobile application interactivity may falter is a lack of ability to properly teach woodwind or brass instruments. There are several applications that provide virtual woodwind or brass instruments to activate when the user blows air into the microphone of the device. This may help the student to learn to read or have proper placement, but an essential part of a woodwind or brass instrument is skill in the placement of the lips on the instrument. Without practicing this important skill, the instrumentalist won't be able to play one note on a real instrument. Obviously, mobile applications have their limitations. Possibly someday, they could be modified to match the real-world counterparts as much as possible. Why learning music using mobile application is important, and why should it be learned? Learning music using mobile applications is important because learning music has shown to improve learning in other subjects. Music consists of mathematics, memorization, literature, history, and even physics. Learning to read music uses math to count rhythm and keep time. Memorization comes into play when learning a song, remember finger placement, and training your ears to remember pitches. Music has a vast history that spans thousands of years. All of music history intertwines with world history, U.S. history, and ancient history. A student can even learn to understand the physics of sound reverberation. By learning some of the aspects of music, a student naturally improves in other subjects because a lot of the same content can be applied. Music education can be greatly enhanced by the use of mobile applications. Their flexibility and most importantly their mobility make them the tools of tomorrow, today. Keeping in mind the overall benefit of learning on the go and at the soonest desired pace make mobile application a fantastic tool for learning music. Hopefully one day mobile applications can bring music education to even the most remote corners of the world, improving the health and quality of life for each and every person.